CIET NCERT presents audiobook Anand activity book for Bal Vatika help with the worksheets The following are the notes for the teachers to help children while doing the worksheets However these may be altered depending on the needs and interests of children Each worksheet has a border with a certain design or pattern Once the child completes the worksheet the child can be encouraged to complete the design or pattern on the border Activity 1 My picture frame Encourage children to draw the parts of their own face and color it Later ask them to create the frame of their picture by continuing the given pattern using colorful crayons Activity 2 all about me let children talk about themselves and their family ask children to paste their family photograph in the space provided then encourage children to draw or fill their favorite color draw their favorite shape in the given space let children sing the rhyme myself with actions activity 3 understanding self help the children understand that they are part of a family and that every member plays a different role in their families hold a discussion with children about how to follow their family values and traditions activity 4 my family and my friends let children observe the picture and talk about it for example ask questions such as what is happening in the picture Once children have observed the picture let them talk about it in detail then ask anticipatory questions from children for example do you also visit someone's house with your parents when you go to someone's house how do you greet them whose house do you like to visit the most if someone asks you to introduce yourself what you will say What do you think the girl is saying to the guests and so on you may prepare a similar picture reading poster on different themes after picture reading ask children to count the number of guests the total number of persons in the picture and identify the similar pattern of clothes activity 5 find the similar object Let the children identify and name the objects in each row. Then ask them to find the picture matching with the one given in the left box and color it. Ask children to trace over the dotted lines using the same color as that of the dot. Activity 6. Complete the bird. The worksheet has the figure of a bird. Let children join the dots to complete the bird and color it or do the paper tearing and pasting in the bird encourage them to say the initial sound of the word bird b and ask them to name the common birds that they see in their surroundings activity 7 my five senses Let the children identify the objects in each row and then match them with the sense organs in the right box. Encourage the child to talk about the sense organs and recite a rhyme on sense organs. Activity 8 Keeping me and my school clean. Help the child understand that it is important to keep ourselves and our surroundings clean. so that we are free of germs and everything around us looks beautiful talk to them about how everything in the classroom and school should be clean and organized let the child match the appropriate objects used for cleaning the body and school with the two pictures given in this activity activity 9 animals and birds around me recite the poem mai to so rahi thi with actions with the children in the classroom 
encourage children to keep adding the names and sounds of animals and birds and continue the rhyme. Involve children in making animals or birds flashcards or puppets with easily available material and let them create a story or rhyme using animal flashcards or puppets. Activity 10. I have feelings. Help the child understand that we all have feelings but it is important to learn to cope up with our feelings. Then ask the child to match the feelings with appropriate faces with similar expressions. Do some activities that will help them learn to cope up with their feelings. Activity 11. Healthy Foods Discuss healthy and unhealthy food habits. Encourage children to identify and name each food item. Ask children what they eat often in a day. Then ask the child to circle the healthy foods in each row. Activity 12. Animals I know. Let children talk about the animals that they know and have seen in their immediate surroundings. Let the child identify and name each animal and make sounds of the same. Then ask the child to put the index finger on each animal and say the initial sound of its name. Ask them to start tracing the animals from the yellow dot, follow the arrow and finish on the red dot. While the children are joining the dots, encourage them to observe the food of the animals and let them think what the lion likes to eat. Activity 13. Find the odd one out. Let children identify and name the pictures in each row and ask them to encircle the odd one out in each row and then trace over the dotted lines. Activity 14. Big or small object. Let children identify and name big and small objects like big and small umbrellas and balls. Then encourage them to color the big object red and the small object blue. Activity 15. Match the shapes. Encourage children to identify and match the shapes by drawing a line. Later ask them to tear and paste their favorite colored paper in the shapes. Activity 16. Animals I know. Let children talk about the animals that they know and have seen in their immediate surroundings. Let the child identify and name each animal and make sounds of the same. Then ask the child to put the index finger on each animal and say the initial sound of its name. Ask them to start tracing the animals from the yellow dot Follow the arrow and finish on the red dot. While the children are joining the dots, encourage them to observe the food of the animals and let them think what the lion likes to eat. Activity 17. Things I do before going to school. Let children look at the pictures, number the pictures in the correct order. Ask them to describe the action in each picture. Encourage them to draw their school in the last box. You may ask children to cut out each picture and arrange in the correct order and describe the arrangement. Activity 18 My favorite food Help children recite or sing the rhyme with actions. Talk about their favorite food and relate it with the worksheets 18 and 19 done before on healthy foods. Talk about how plants help us, what food do we get from plants and so on. Activity 19. Color the shapes. Explain the worksheet to the children. Encourage them to identify and name the shapes and color the shapes as mentioned in the instructions. Let them color all the triangles in yellow, squares in green and circles in blue color. 
Activity 20. Stay safe. Help the children understand the safe and unsafe situations and discuss what they should do in such a situation. Be careful not to scare them. Let each child feel special and let them understand they have the right to feel safe and protected. Also talk about how they can keep themselves safe. Make them learn the various helpline numbers. In this worksheet, ask them to observe the pictures and tick the safe and unsafe tags as per the pictures. Activity 21 Find and circle the differences. Let children observe both the pictures. Ask them to find out the differences between both the pictures and circle the differences. You may prepare similar worksheets for children on different themes. Activity 22. Find and color the pattern. Let children look at the pattern and fill the colors in the pattern. Encourage them to describe the pattern. For example, apple, banana, apple, banana and again apple and so on. Activity 23. Create with shapes. The worksheet has a few shapes drawn on the top. Encourage children to create figures, designs or patterns using these shapes. Later ask them to color their pattern, design or figure. Activity 24. My Creative Circles the worksheet has six circle outlines and children are encouraged to create anything of their choice from the given circles. One circle is given as an example. It is a picture of the sun. Activity 25 My Toys Picture Reading Let children observe the picture and talk about it. You may create a story on the picture. Ask children to identify and name the toys. Count them and name the toys that they play with etc. Involve them in creating and making of a toy using the no cost materials or any materials easily available around them in the nature. Activity 26 My Collage let children cut their favorite pictures related to body hygiene and cleanliness from old newspapers and magazines using a child-friendly scissor. Ask them to paste these as a collage in the given box. Encourage children to write a few lines about the pictures in the collage in their own way. Activity 27 Animals and birds around me. Recite the poem, Chirp, Chirp, says the bird, with actions with the children in the classroom. Encourage children to keep adding the names and sounds of animals and birds and continue the rhyme. Involve children in making animals or birds flashcards or puppets with easily available material and let them create a story or rhyme using animal flashcards or puppets. Activity 28 Layatmak Shabd Milan Match the rhyming words. Let children observe the pictures given in this activity, name them and match the names of pictures rhyming with each other by drawing lines. Activity 29 Rhyming words. Let children observe and name the pictures and discuss how their names rhyme with each other. Pal, Nal, Jug, Tub, etc. Ask them to color the happy faces if the names of pictures rhyme and if they do not rhyme. Ask them to color the sad face. Activity 30. Counting objects. Numbers from 1 to 10. Let children observe and count the number of objects and encircle the number of objects as directed in each box. For example, 
and circle 10 rotis. Then the child is expected to circle only 10 rotis and so on. Activity 31. Maze Let children trace the maze with their index finger and help Sia take her cow to the cow shed. Then ask them to use a thick color pencil to trace and draw a line in the maze and help Sia to take her cow to the cow shed. Activity 32 Biggest and Smallest Ask children to tear and paste red colored paper in the biggest object and yellow colored paper in the smallest object. Activity 33. Follow the pattern. Let children look at the patterns, describe them and follow the same pattern in the given space. Activity 34 and 35. Draw and reach the correct number. Let the children count and practice tracing the path with their finger. Then draw a line in the given path and match with the correct number of circles. Activity 36. Complete the caterpillar. Let children draw the number of circles to complete the caterpillar in each row. We can provide a similar worksheet to practice, like add the given number of coaches to the train, etc. Activity 37. The Lion and the Mouse Show the story cards and narrate the story to children. Ask questions like, what is this story about? Where did the story happen? What was the problem in the story? Which animals do you see in the pictures? What do you like in the story? Can you give another title to the story? Then encourage them to cut the story cards along the dotted lines using the child-friendly scissors and arrange them in the correct order and retell the story in their own words. Activity 38 The Hunter and the Pigeon Let children read the story cards and discuss what is the story about? Where did the story happen? What was the problem in the story? What did the birds do to get out of the net? Which bird has been shown in the story cards? Name the other birds you see in your locality and so on. Then ask children to count the number of pigeons in each story card. Encourage children to cut the story cards along the dotted lines using the child-friendly scissors and arrange the story cards in the correct order and retell the story in their own words. Later, children may be introduced to the popular song titled Ek Chiriya Anek Chiriya. Activity 39 Just the right size Let the child identify and label the pictures as big, medium and small as per their size. You may create a story on the given pictures or let the children create a story where they use the mathematical vocabulary such as big, bigger, biggest or small, smaller, smallest and so on. Then using the child-friendly scissors, let children cut the pictures with dotted lines and paste at the appropriate place. For example, the medium bowl needs to be pasted below the medium doll and so on. Activity 40. Big and Small Ask children to paste big and small size shapes cut from the old magazines or newspapers in the given blank space. Activity 41. Red Fort. Talk about Independence Day, our national festival and its importance. Let the child color the national flag and the red fort. 
Activity 42. Kindness for others. Have a discussion in circle time activity and talk about how we always need to treat animals with kindness. We must be kind in our actions. Let the children recite the poems with actions. Read aloud a story on animals. Help the children make a fish by paper folding and let them paste the fish in the given space. They can also draw a fish. Activity 43 Healthy Foods Discuss healthy and unhealthy food habits. Encourage children to identify and name each food item. Ask children what they eat often in a day. Then ask the child to circle the healthy foods in each row. Activity 44 and 45 At the playground Picture reading Let children look at the picture of a playground and talk about what is happening in it. Ask creative and critical thinking questions. Some of the examples are given in the worksheet. Take children to a nearby park and let them enjoy free outdoor play. Ask them to collect fallen leaves, twigs, flowers, etc. And do the sorting and pattern making. Show and tell activities in the classroom. Later, let children use the things or collections they have found to make a collage and do leaf printing, flower printing, etc. Activity 46 My 10 Balloons Create a story about Meena and Ravi. Tell them how once both wanted to play with colourful balloons. Let children add to the story and give a title to the story. Then ask them to count the balloons. Colour them and then draw a string with each balloon and join the first bunch of balloons to the hands of Meena and the second bunch of balloons to the hands of Ravi. Finally, ask them to count the total number of balloons and write it in the box. Activity 47. Count and Colour Ask the children to count the number of coaches of the train and colour them as per the colours given to each number. Sing a rhyme on numbers. Let the children collect empty matchboxes or food containers or anything else easily available and having no cost and guide them to create a small train with the material. Observe the children working in groups and how they talk to each other and share their material. Talk about Have you ever been on a train journey? Where have you been? What other modes of transport have you seen? Do you enjoy travelling, etc.? Activity 48 I clean myself. Let children talk about the objects that are used to keep one's body clean. Encourage them to draw the appropriate objects as per the instructions given in the box and colour them. Activity 49. Road Safety. Picture Reading. Help children understand that being safe on the roads is very important. Guide them to follow the rules and safety procedures and discuss the signs written on the roadside. Then ask them to find and encircle the signs that they see commonly in their surroundings, especially near the road. Ask them to tick the people who are safe and cross the ones who are unsafe. Activity 50. A clean body. Let children look at the objects used to clean the body and ask them to identify and name them. Then ask them to match and circle the pictures given in each row with the body parts given in the box on the left side. For example, in the first row, the child is expected to match and encircle the soap and shampoo and comb with the picture of hair on the left side. 
encourage the children to talk about the things they use for cleaning their body. Activity 51. Draw as directed, as per your senses. This worksheet has empty boxes for each of the senses like Things I see, things I hear, things I touch, things I smell and things I taste. Let the child draw objects as per the sense organs given. Activity 52 Patterns with fruits. Let children observe the different patterns of fruits. Describe each pattern to them and ask them to complete the pattern in each row by drawing the fruits. Activity 53. Counting vehicles. Talk about the different modes of transport by discussing the vehicles that run on fuel. The classification of vehicles as per land, water and air transport and so on. Ask children to count and write the number of vehicles in the given boxes. Let them play with toy vehicles. Ask them to draw the picture of their favorite vehicle and create DIY, do-it-yourself, toy vehicles using waste and no-cost material. Activity 54 Ga Vale Chitre Dhundho Bacho ko chitro ka avlokan karne de, unka naam likhne ke liye kahe, aur ga vale chitre dhund kar unme rang bharne de. Activity 55 Pha Vale Chitre Dhundho Bacho ko chitro ka avlokan karne de. उनका नाम लिखने के लिए कहें और फ वाले चित्र ढूंढकर उनमें रंग भरने दें। Activity 56 Match the shapes on the dresses. Let children observe the picture and talk about the different shapes in the dresses in the picture. Then encourage children to match the dresses of children having same shapes. Finally, ask them to count the number of shapes and write it in the given boxes. Activity 57. Find and match the figure. Let children observe each row carefully and find the matching image as given in the left box with the image in the right row. You may encourage the child to talk about the direction and position of the objects. Once children complete the matching, ask them to join the dotted lines. Activity 58 and 59 Little Bird Let children observe and talk about what is happening in the picture. You may ask questions like, Do you see any birds around your school or your house? Which are those birds? Where do you think they live? If a bird comes to your house, what will you do with it? Why do you think the bird comes to the window and balcony of your house? Will you keep that bird as a pet at your house? Then encourage the child to First, identify the pair of rhyming words in the poem. Second, what is the initial sound you hear in the word bird? What are the other words that begin with the same initial sound, bur? Talk about birds that the children see in their environment. Let children make the sounds of birds. Help children make a bird with a paper folding technique. Tell children story on birds with the help of puppets or any other thing. Activity 60. Measure heights in your own way, non-standard units. Let children look at the pictures of and count the number of squares. Ask them to color the squares according to the height of the giraffe. Let children measure their own height using ribbons and compare it with the height of their friends. Activity 61. Measure lengths in your own way, non-standard units. 
Let children look at the modes of transport and color the blocks according to the length of the vehicles and also count the number of blocks and write it in the box. Activity 62 India Gate Talk about India Gate and help children to recite the poem. Then ask children to join the numbers to complete the picture of India Gate. Sing rhymes and encourage children to say aloud the numbers in order and join the dots. Show picture charts or videos to children on the same. Activity 63. Find the toys. Discuss the picture given in the activity. Let the child observe the picture and trace the dotted lines with the index finger first and then trace over the dotted lines using the colour pencil or crayon to reach the toys. Activity 64 Care and Hygiene Chart Explain the care and hygiene chart to children as shown in the worksheet. Let each child put a tick mark in each box for the activity they have done in a day of the week for their self-care and hygiene. Ask the child to use the same sheet to mark for each day and towards the end of the week. They are expected to count and write the number of tick marks in the last column for the number of days they have done the activity. Activity 65 Tracing Lines let children observe the pattern and first trace over the dots using their index finger. Then, ask them to trace the dotted lines to complete the trees with the same color as that of the dots. Encourage them to create a story of their own. You may ask them to do so in pairs or in small groups. Activity 66 Count and Write Explain each picture to children. Let them put fingers on each item as they count. Then ask them to count and write the number of objects in the box. Activity 67 Numbers Let children count and color the flowers in each box. Then fill up the color in the correct circle showing the number of flowers. Let children talk about the variety of flowers they see in their surroundings. If possible, ask children to collect the fallen flowers from their surroundings and encourage them to make sets of flowers, collage with flowers and so on. Activity 68 and 69 0. Let children recite the whole poem. Talk about the birds they see in their immediate surroundings. Encourage them to repeat the poem and write the number as they sing. One flew away and continue till they finish the activity. Activity 70. Play with numbers. Let children identify and count the objects and find the total number of objects. Do such activities with other manipulatives and concrete materials during playtime. Activity 71 Dhwani Chitra Milan Let children identify and name the pictures. Then ask them to encircle the beginning aksharas of the name of the picture. You may prepare similar worksheets for the remaining aksharas and their sounds. Activity 72 Dhwani Chitra Milan Let children identify and name the pictures. Then, ask them to encircle the beginning aksharas of the name of the picture. You may prepare similar worksheets for the remaining aksharas and their sounds. Activity 73 Patterns with Geometric Shapes let children observe the different patterns of shapes. Describe each pattern to them and ask them to complete the pattern in each row by drawing the shapes. Activity 74 Adding up the vegetables 
Let children identify and name the vegetables. Ask them to count the number of vegetables and write the total number in the given baskets. Activity 75. Planes. One less plane counting. Talk about air transport. Let children count the number of planes and cross out one plane and then finally write the number of planes. Ask them to make a paper plane. Activity 76. Join the dots. Discuss the importance of washing hands before and after eating and after using the toilet. Let children join the dots of aksharas in sequence and complete the picture and read the aksharas aloud in order. Only few aksharas are shown in the worksheet as example. Display the aksharas chart with corresponding pictures at the eye level of children in the classroom as a part of literacy rich classroom. Activity 77 Vegetables Talk about the vegetables children know about and eat at home. Then let children identify, name and count the number of vegetables given in each row. Then encourage them to draw the vegetables in the boxes given on the right side to match the number of vegetables given on the left side. Activity 78 Beginning Letter Sounds let children identify and name each of the six pictures. Then encourage them to say the initial sound of the name of each animal or bird. For example, hen, h, peacock, p, etc. You may also encourage them to say which other animal's name starts with the initial sound h, p, etc. After this, ask them to write the first letter of the name of each picture in the boxes given below each picture. Activity 79 My Colourful Puzzle Explain the puzzle maze to the children. Let children colour the puzzle maze using the same colour as given in the worksheet. Activity 80-91 to Exemplar Theme-Based Worksheet in addition to the given worksheets, there are 12 more worksheets based on the themes My Family and Animals. These thematic worksheets are exemplar. Teacher can create more search worksheets on different themes. Activity 92 Game on Good and Bad Habits Snake and Ladders this worksheet on good and bad habits is based on the popular board game, Snakes and Ladders. After doing Activity 91, ask children to tear the sheets, paste the game on any thicker board and play with dice and counters. You may provide waste-colored bottle caps as counters. Discuss the rules of the game with children and let children know about the importance of following good habits in life. You were just listening to this audiobook. Narrator Mamta Malkani and Farhan Ali Nakvi Technical Coordinator Bati Lang Lingdo Sound Recordist Vikas Sangwan Assistance in Production Ruchi Sharma Directed and Produced by Vimlesh Chaudhary. This audiobook is presented to you by CIET NCERT, New Delhi, India.